It doesn't get a whole lot of attention in North America, but in a lot of ways, the cruiserweight division provides everything boxing fans want. For almost a decade, the best fighters in the cruiserweight division have all faced one another, with very few exceptions. That trend continues this weekend, and this time, fans in the United States and Canada can actually watch. Integrated Sports Pay-Per-View presents a world title doubleheader as WBC champion Christoph Ladarczyk defends against Gregory Drosht, and Denis Lebedev puts his WBA strap on the line against Pavel Kolodze. Ladarczyk is one of the sport's longest reigning champions, effectively holding a title since 2009. He's best known for his trilogy with Jacoby Fragameni, a trio of entertaining fights that concluded with a sixth-round stoppage last December. When he hasn't been battling his Italian rival, he scored impressive wins over Danny Green and, more recently, Rakim Chakiev. In Drocht, he'll face another seasoned veteran, but one that presents an entirely different look than the seek-and-destroy cruiserweights that mostly populate the division. Drocht is a mobile boxer who throws a ton of jabs and maintains an impressive work rate for a 35-year-old cruiserweight. Pretty Boy has mostly rolled through the standard fare of gatekeepers, but scored the best win of his career in absolutely carving up Mateus Masternak last year to win the European title. In the co-feature, Denis Lebedev tries to bounce back after a savage yet controversial loss to Guillermo Jones. Though Jones went on to test positive for performance-enhancing drugs, it doesn't erase the brutal beating Lebedev sustained at his hands last year. In order to salvage his career, perhaps, the Russian tank acquired the services of Hall of Fame trainer Freddy Roach and has spent much of his camp training at the Wild Card Gym in Hollywood, California. It's no secret that Roach knows a thing or two about how to mold power-punching southpaws, so the marriage would seem to be a good one. His opponent, Koloje, is in a lot of ways the polar opposite of Lebedev. Polish contender is a tall, lanky, safety-first boxer who likes to be at range and uses his legs to keep distance as often as possible. Kolodziej has also never been in a fight he hasn't been favored to win. Many are high on his skill set, but it hasn't yet been truly put to the test. Of the four cruisers featured on the pay-per-view, he's the only one not ranked inside Ring Magazine's top 10 and is looking to change that. On Saturday, we'll get another pair of good cruiserweight matchups. The question is, but we get another pair of new champions as well.